Hi, Dr. Brad with Weedman Lawn Care. It's extremely challenging to keep our lawns nice and healthy through the summer with the heat and oftentimes drought conditions. Today we're on a lawn that's been significantly impacted by summer patch. Summer patch is a disease, as it explains in the name, that we see in the middle of the summer as soil temperatures reach 65 degrees or higher. Summer patch can be very similar to a disease called necrotic ring spot because both of those diseases severely damage the roots to a point where the leaves just tear away right from the root base. The downside to both of these diseases is they usually require reseeding of the damaged area and it can be really difficult to tell the difference between the two. Really the best way to tell the difference is to take a sample and submit it to your turf grass diagnostic lab for viewing and they can easily tell you the difference by looking at the roots. Oftentimes with summer patch it will start off as very small areas maybe a few inches in diameter and as you can see behind me it can coalesce into much larger areas that can take over the entire lawn. A summer patch traditionally will cause damage on Kentucky bluegrass or other bluegrasses along with fine fescue plants. And you can see here we have a very healthy tall fescue plant in this lawn that has remained unharmed from that disease. Now really to avoid damage from summer patch we want to make sure we do a great job with our cultural practices on the lawn. That includes proper mowing at three inches, that includes proper fertilization practices and also proper watering. One of the mistakes I often see is we get brown areas like this on the turf and we assume that's drought because it's usually midsummer when we're not receiving rainfall so oftentimes people start to irrigate their lawn even more and those saturated conditions really help this disease take over the lawn. If you do see damaged areas in your lawn it could be a variety of different things including insect, disease, or drought damage so I highly encourage you to contact a local professional to help you with the diagnosis to make sure we get the correct treatment on your property. As I mentioned earlier, a lot of these issues are going to require reseeding and I highly recommend you wait till later in the fall because of the heat and challenging conditions we see in the summer. If you have any additional questions about summer patch or other diseases, feel free to visit our website at weedman.com.